what is up YouTube it is Matty and welcome to this video where we are going to try a live three star attack so I've already had a chance to scout the base it's town hall 10 versus town hall 10 and it is in an arranged war so there are anti three star bases everywhere and um, it's going to be a challenging one I'm versus number nine um, let's have a little look so it's a mat it was um it's a pretty decently level town hall 10 you can see um, I think the archer towers and the cannons are all upper level, um, so 12 cannons, 12 archer towers as well. Level 2 infernos, which isn't the uh, the greatest, the one max expo, so, you know, it's it's pretty pretty well, um, well pretty, pretty on a good upgrade path. A couple of uh, Teslas, um, sorry, all of the Teslas are max level as well, those are the ones obviously you can't see. Now... On my scout, I thought up an idea, and I think uh, it's got legs. I think I can uh, can run with it actually. A um, couple of little amendments, I think, that will get me the three star. But it, at the start, you can see loads of buildings I'm able to chuck minions on. And the reason I'm doing this is number one, they're going to help me scout. Uh, sorry, they're going to help me funnel. Um, so in a minute, I'm going to need to get my Valkyries in, and uh, I'll be able to because the minions have created a nice, easy sort of run in. And I'll also need to get my queen to break in as well. And because a nice wide funnel's been created, I've also got a free defense up here with the cannon. Um, but everything seems to have gone off nicely. Now what I should have done here, like at this point, is thrown a single hog rider down to get the CC pull. Because that would have allowed me to, um, to sort of take the clan castle with a rage spell. Now when I'm out of the inferno range... Because my idea is to kill that Inferno Tower with my Queen Queen Charge. Um, and take down all the defences, of course. Um, but because I end up dealing with the CC with my Queen there. And, and popping the ability nice and early. Um, which was a, not a good thing. Um, it meant that when the Inferno was just locked on. and, and down, Along with the Expo. It put me into a bit of a, a bad position, shall we say. So, yeah definitely can work on that bit then we're going to look at the valk entry um, I sort of put them on the outside so they all came into the middle um, I'm going to use a rage spell here to push them through um, and then a second rage spell into the inferno tower and the heroes but what I did the mistake the biggest mistake I made here was uh, the jump spell placement didn't it did, <laughs> didn't get me in deep enough so that was a complete failure on my part there and then everything just fizzled out so yeah um, I think we've got legs in that plan. I think I can work with it. Um, just going to be a case of using that hog rider to pull the CC early, get more value for my queen, get the Inferno Town, um, Inferno Tower, and then jump. Use my jump actually effectively to get to that Inferno Tower as well. So yeah, good rage spell use, good heal spell placement. All that I think was going to help me um, with the triple. I've got some hogs for the back end. I've got some loons as well. You can see I just need to gem off my final rage spell. Here we go. And I think we're going to be good for the raid. So I've got nine minions. I should have, there we go, look, a single wizard just for cleanup. Um, four loons because, um, oh, I'll talk to you about after anyway. Hopefully I can get a decent triple. So here we go on number nine. Let's give it a shot. Okay. Getting ready with the minions. Okay, I'm going to start up here. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Get one on that cannon as well. Get the queen down. Up here. Healers on her. Give her enough chance to sort of take down these buildings okay single hog going in gonna get a nice early CC pull that's the idea uh, okay gonna take down these loons now the dragons coming in from a bit of an awkward angle but I'm gonna use him to take it down rage over here wall breakers to break her in and we're in okay. So we're looking good at this point. I'm hoping um, she's going to get that Inferno Tower down. That is the whole goal of this. Um, what I need her to do. 
Whew, it's a nerve-wracking thing. Gonna t try and time her ability well. Um, okay, here we go. Ability. Get the shots off on the Inferno. Get it down. Happy days. Now we can look at the Valkyries. Valks over here. Rage in here. King. Uh, jump. Just put the jump over here. Rage. Heal. Okay. Hog Riders. One, two. One, two. Another one over here. A couple of loons. Uh, ability there. I'm going to drop. Dropping the loons in where I see fit. Just trying to get everything dead. Hopefully we're going to be on for this. Um, I can't quite tell at the moment if we're being honest. I don't know. Come on. Come on, guys. This is going to be so close. Oh, man. I'm getting hit so hard. Uh... I don't think I've got enough to get the triple, guys. Oh, it's so close. Um, unfortunately, no. Damn. I got, well, as you can tell, getting really close to um, to all the defences gone. I did so much better with the Queen. The uh, Getting the Valkyries in will be interesting to see how much or how little they ended up getting. Because um, I think I uh, it did quite well, but it's going to be like a 93-94%. Um, 94% is it going to be? Looks... 95, happy days. Uh, it doesn't matter too much though at the end of the day. There we go, look. Um, 96. Damn! I think that's got... That plan has got legs. Um, hmm. Bad heal. That's what Scott's saying. Let's have a little look. Um, we're going to watch it back and see where it went right, see where it went wrong. And hopefully that's going to be enough for someone to uh, to work with, to get a triple on the base. Um, damn. Okay. Uh, let's have a look at... The, yeah, I think all we can do now is sort of see where which bits you would change or I would change. I think the Valkyrie... I think I should have got the jump spell down a little bit sooner. I don't think, think that affected it too much. You can see I took the cannon down. All the minions worked fine. Um, I was a bit late on the wall breakers. Got that hog down to get the CC pull. I didn't expect the CC to go after the minion, of course. I thought they would go straight after the uh, the queen. Um, that, that was a little bit of a surprise you hear when you see the dragon just sort of diverting off. Um, when Especially when the loons went to target the queen. So that was odd. But... Poisons are, the poison's down, the queen's in. This point I should have been thinking about the um, the wall breakers. I did that second uh, second poison there to help the dragon. Raging those wall breakers through and in. Getting me a nice entry point close to that inferno tower was all brilliant. The, and with the rage spell still in effect with the healers, there's barely anything hitting me now. And I actually was able to dodge the expo, which is even cooler. Um, the Valk entry was pretty fine i think i mean i it was going to be a hard work because of the um the hit well yeah to get to get a good portion of this base i was obviously nervous that i'd miss the jump so i placed it sort of overcompensated should we say didn't expect the queen to go all the way back outside here that wasn't necessarily a bad thing but here go the max valks look straight in the rage spell pushing them through the base catching that first um and here they go look straight in rage heal spell Looks like I might be missing the most of the Valks with the heal though. Um, it's slightly delayed in getting them onto that Inferno. Um, once they were through, maybe that heal spell should have been placed a bit deeper into the base towards these defences here. I mean, I think the clear obvious thing is, yes, Scott was right. Bad heal spell. A lot of my Valks died because of it. Um, I'm, I was massively surprised those loons didn't end up getting their wizard tower down. Um, they did, both didn't get their hit off, which is a, which is a real shame. Because uh, I think that ended up affecting as well. So, yeah. Um, I think with this sort of thing, you know, you, I've, I've pretty much identified every giant bomb. I've identified every um, trap that those... Um, the giant bomb next to the Inferno is deadly as hell. 
So that was a little bit uh, concerning. I should have got that air defense down sooner. I'd have, I'd have kept healers alive, which then might have been a bit easier. But, well, she, she'd have still had to run through. So maybe a bit of a better plan for this side of the base. Maybe hog riding instead of those loons would have been better as well. There's so many things, um, but I guess it's going to be up to the next person who wants to hit the base to see what they would do to get the three star. For me, unfortunately, not able to do it on this one, but hopefully next time I can. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one, and I'll see you then. Peace.